Okay, so having uh, set up the, the tubing, um, <coughs> like I said before, you can close this valve just whilst it's waiting. Um, and then what we're going to do is connect it to the, uh, the place arterial cannula uh, and zero the line. You can actually zero the line uh, before attaching, but most people you tend to attach first and then zero. Okay, so here we have patient. So cap off, twist onto the to make sure that flow switch is open. Um, that attaches to the monitor. But for this demonstration, I'll just leave this here so we can see. Um, so essentially, the, all the measuring part components are in this small transducer here. Um, so the oscillations from the artery will be pushing all this column of fluid into that. A little diaphragm will measure it here and, and change it into an electric signal to measure at the, at the monitor. Um, this valve, the, the long arm is off. So at the moment, you can see it goes through here all the way to the, uh, to the bag and to the transducer. To zero it, what we want is the transducer measuring air. So we have to turn it off to the patient, take that off. So now the open part is basically air into the transducer. Um, so now when we press zero on the monitor, it will measure the pressure in the air here. Wait for it to beep and then we can replace that and usually turn that back open to the patient. Um, and then, you know, if, if everything's connected correctly, you'll then see the waveform come up on the, on the monitor.